While this may look like your local butcher shop, you might be surprised to see that it's actually an agriturismo, or local farm. One that gives tourists an authentic taste of the Italian countryside. Roberto Blasi is the owner of Agriturismo Calacozzo. Every agriturismo is built on the owner's own personality and taste. We built this agriturismo ourselves, and it takes a lot of passion and a strong will to work. The Italian government provides funding for farms that become agriturismi, bed and breakfast for travelers. And without this money, Roberto's farm may not have survived. The farm exists because the agriturismo is here, and the agriturismo exists because there is a farm behind it. Many visitors enjoy the tranquility and silence of the countryside. And Karen Milik is one of those visitors staying at Calacozzo with her family for the fourth time. This is really one of the most beautiful surroundings you can have in all of the district here. You're really surrounded by mountains and with every change in the weather, in the light of the sun, in the morning, in the evening, you see every time again something new. And it's a feeling you only get here in this place. Calacozzo sells all foods grown on the farm directly to visitors, who then cook their own meals. Roberto advises and helps to properly prepare meals, at times cooking for his guests. Here you have somebody like uh, Roberto, who makes all his own meat, his own everything. You can buy the meat here, and everything what you can eat and taste here is house-made. It's the Italian way of life. Roberto makes his own sausages, salami, and ham, as well as his own cheeses, grains, and honey. He also provides an array of local wines, all from the Marche region of Italy. Lots of agriturismos. The people are proud of what they've made. They make something beautiful out of it, and yes, they have the right to be proud of it. The agriturismo attracts visitors like Karen because of Roberto's hard work and devotion, as well as his love for the land. It's a man, it's a family, because it's he and his wife. Very nice people, and they really, their heart is in it. And he, he treats you like family, and that's very nice. There are no vacations and no sick days, and every day is a challenge because we are always influenced by the weather conditions. But it's a beautiful part of it. 